and fight for the gold medal, 79 kilos category. In the red, the silver medalist in the World Junior Championship 2016 from Russia, Ahmed Usmanov. A huge final here for gold at 79 kilograms, Ahmed Usmanov of Russia. Looking to get Russia back on the golden trail. They certainly had expectations that they might face up to major challenges here. The man standing between the Russian and top spot, Mohamed Nuri Kontanoglu of Turkey. So underway here in the final of the 79 kilogram competition. Usmanov of Russia, Kotanoglu of Turkey in this wrestle for gold. Usmanov, the Russian champion, huge importance to uh, the team Russia because that can go a long way to fix up a Olympic spot. Such is the competitive nature of Russian team. Usmanov in a rush for gold. Early two-pointer, taken to four with the roll. And he takes a superb six-pointer overall to lead in the final. Well, Usmanov rolled to technical superiority over Balayan Gurav of India to reach this final. After going seven up in the first period, Usmanov scoring with a step out and takedown to close out the match. And already 6-0 in this first round. Kotanoglu edge pass Vasil Kelov, who we saw just take bronze medal. That was 4-4 on criteria. Turkish wrestler scored a four-point move in the opening period. And eventually proved to pay dividends. He had two bronze medals either side of COVID shutdown. He's already guaranteed himself a medal here. But at the moment, it's looking highly likely to be of silver in nature with Usmanov with that takedown and a couple of rolls looking to have found gold at the bottom of the river. Well, a minute left of this first round. Kotanoglu just wanted to try and get some kind of grip on the match, and certainly on Usmanov. But easier said than done. Russia with already one gold on the night from Magomedov. At 61 kilograms and very much on song for another at 79. So far, it's five from seven finals in freestyle for Team Russia. And a sixth looking likely with a six point lead at the end of the first round. Kotanoglu of Turkey with a mountain to climb. He has been a European bronze medalist in 2019, a former under 23 European champion. The Turk heavily up against it. At the moment, he looks like he's going to have to settle for silver because Usmanov is in a rush to show his dominance. The Russian is looking very hungry to pick up a gold medal here at the Belgrade World Cup. Coach. 
Another of the long line of ready Russians for top class gold medal action. This would be his only third golden moment, having won the Ali Aliyev tournament in 2018. The same year he won the Vladimir Semenov tournament. Four medal spots, but it wasn't until October's Russia Championships he got himself back on top of the podium. And he's looking to be back there unless Kotanoglu can find something special before the close. He's got two minutes 15 to find it. And he went for it. He had to be aggressive. So Usmanov just reading the situation. And takes the gold medal. There will be a challenge, but there seems little doubt that the roar of the Russian bear is going to be confirmed as a victory soon enough. Well, it's a devastated looking Kotanoglu. And maybe his coach's challenge just extending the pain. He can't be accused of not taking a chance. He shot for the legs of Usmanov. The Russians so quick to read it and then counter. And unless there's something untoward, risk, risk. will be gold for Russia. In our third gold medal match on the final day of the Belgrade World Cup, confirmation, an added point in his pocket. Fist pumping from the Russian champion. He's on top of the podium again. Kotanoglu outclassed as Usmanov will be back later this evening to pick up a hugely well-deserved gold medal.